ld professionals video tutorials in this tutorial we talk about multi currency talk about creating currencies creating rates of exchange and displaying our financial statement in other currencies so we go to tally under our masters menu we have account info then we go to currencies in case your currency is not showing we can come to features f11 then we go to accounting features so under accounting features make sure that allow multi currency is set to yes so when it's set to yes you now say control a to accept so now press the escape key so your currencies will be showing so we select it to so display what is there already that's our naira nigerian naira i press the escape that's now create new one and call it dollars i put the symbol shift and four for my laptop to give me dollar sign you now write dollars showing millions yes is symbols of this to amount no it is prefix put a space between symbol no the symbol for decimal portion of amount that is cent just as we have nine and cobalt so these are our dollars and cents i will say enter enter and accept so and so on and so forth to create more currencies so i press the escape key I just want to create rate of exchange as at 1st of January 2012 let me assume that my standard rate is 160 that if I'm to sell it I will sell it as 162 when I'm buying it I buy it at 158. So I'll accept it. So that's how to create my rate of exchange. So if you have other currencies, you can always create new and create their rate of exchange. So I'll press my escape key. I want to now display my financial that's my balance sheet. I can press detailed so this is the details of my balance sheet so I'll now press alter column alt a alter column by the right hand side I'll press it and I'll press enter I will now select my dollars and to reflect my fin my balance sheet in dollars so I'll press dollars I select it so I can always change the rate of exchange yeah in case it has changed so I'll press enter default enter so it's now showing my balance sheet in dollars in dollars at 160 naira per dollar as at 1st of January 2012 so these are all our amount in dollars everything in dollars So I press I do same for 
my PNL account. I say detail. There's no much details in my PNL account. So I press escape. In this tutorial, we talked about multi currency, creating multi currencies, creating rates of exchange and displaying financial statement in other currency for instance we displayed it in dollars i hope this has been informative for you and i want to thank you for viewing